about 35 acres here, and then the other side of the farmstead, there's another 25, 90 acres here. I wasn't expecting to see this when I came over the hill, all this yellow. What it is, I believe, is a cover crop that I drilled last August, a turnip and radish. Kind of see, somehow they made it through the winter and they germinated. I was expecting to come down here, it's about 12 miles south of the main farm. And this is the organic potash and gypsum I'm spreading at 200 pounds an acre. S expecting just to come down and then disc it once and um, field cultivate and then plant the soybeans here. Got three or four days of nice weather. It's June 8th. Um, I think now that brassica is three or four feet tall. I'm going to have to flail mow that in order to break it down so that it'll pass through my time reader, my cultivator. I haven't actually started spreading yet. They spread turkey litter. That's where the pathways you see. So I'm going to follow their uh, lead in terms of uh, spacing. We rented a, a spreader from the co-op. And I'm down here at 7220. Hold six tons. I've got 15 tons total here to do this and some ground up by the house. Fortunately, today was the day that the uh, AC decided to quit. And uh, this stuff's pretty caustic, so I need to keep the doors and windows closed. But it is beautiful. I mean, i got to say, I, agronomically, I don't think it's going to cause me any problems. But we'll see. We'll see how it plays out. I already got the corn in. I've time weeded it on 100 acres. So I'm feeling good there. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.